welcome back to my channel um it has been a minute since i filmed a video um if you're new here my name is sadie welcome to the channel i'll put my instagrams down below i have like a makeup instagram and also my normal instagram so i'll put them both down there basically i'm here today because i got ready i've like had a bath and washed my hair and everything and i'm feeling fresh and feeling good so i thought i would sit and film a video because I haven't filmed in so long. Um, I've also moved my part in today and I don't know how I feel about it, but I think it looks kind of nice. It just feels wrong. Um, but yeah, I haven't filmed in a while and um, everyone in the UK will know we're back in like a lockdown, although it doesn't really feel the same as the first time, but I've been feeling more down, I think, this time than I did last time um, just for different reasons than why it was hard the first time if that makes any sense so I basically thought I would just do a little video of some things that I'm going to try and do to stay positive and productive um, and stuff like that in this lockdown we've got four weeks hopefully just four weeks um, but we'll see so yeah that's basically all I'm going to be talking through in this video i'm just thinking whether to make a cup of tea and just sit and be cozy i put my little pink lamp on for some ambiance um so yeah i might actually go get a cup of tea get one yourself and we'll be back to talk about how we're gonna just make the most of being in okay i'm back with a cup of tea which is very hot right now so i'm just gonna leave it there so where to begin um oh i've just thought i should have put them up so that you don't see the ugly black headboard we'll do that now much better so this lockdown this month i'm just gonna say this month it's not locked down we're not locked in you can go outside do you know what i mean so this month one of the things that me and my housemates have been doing is we have been trying to do home workouts nearly every day. Um, sorry, I'm just fiddling with a coat hanger as I speak. Um, they purchased the, I don't know how to say her name, Ariana Atjar, what's she called? They purchased her like at home um, plan uses like resistance bands and stuff so I've been sometimes joining in with theirs sometimes doing my own thing because I do have like some dumbbells so sometimes I like to do something with a bit of weight to it and um, as well as the resistance band stuff so we've been trying to do that and we've also been going on a walk like every day and um, which has been really good like I enjoy going on the walk um, although I am getting a bit fed up because I go on the same route every day but I've actually given myself today off the walks and I think like it's important to do what's going to be best for you this month like if you want to use this month to catch up on sleep and um, pamper yourself like clean the house I don't know get back in touch with some hobbies then you do that and if you want to work out and do lots of reading and essays and stuff do that do whatever is going to benefit you um and i'm trying to do a bit of everything as of today i'm going to try and do one hour of um essay for my uni work every day that i don't have uni so we still have online um lectures and stuff so on the days when i don't have uni i'm going to try and spend like an hour 30 minutes to an hour on my essays to make sure that i'm making progress with them and hopefully I'll be done with them by the time we're going into the next month um, and then I've got all of the Christmas break to just enjoy Christmas rather than writing my essays so I am trying to do that and um, as I said I gave myself today off going on a walk I did my workout this morning um, and then I thought I just want to have a bath and relax and um, sit and watch loads of YouTube like that's just what I wanted to do today so that's what I've done and also got myself ready which felt really good as well because honestly because I'm not going anywhere I just leave my hair to get the greasiest it can be before I wash it and like 
I don't know, I go through phases where I'm like, I think that's a good thing because I'm training my hair to not get dirty as quickly. Like, what's the point in washing it and wasting product? But when your hair's greasy and ratty all the time, you do feel worse, like, in yourself. Do you know what I mean? So, yeah, we've been walking. We've been working out. I'm going to start trying to do some essays daily. Um, just a bit at a time to make sure the progress is, like, steady, you know? What else have we been doing? Oh yeah, I said getting in touch with like hobbies and stuff. Um, I have been trying to do some more like creative makeup looks and stuff like that, which I haven't really done since the first dreaded word. Um, so yeah, on my Instagram, it's Sadie B Beauty. I maybe even put it on the screen. Wow. Um, I've posted two looks so far. And I have another one in mind that I'm going to do probably in a couple of days because I did basically two days in a row almost. So I'm going to give it a couple of days and do the next one that I have in mind. Um, so yeah, that's something that I've been trying to do just to keep me occupied, fill my days. Um, and obviously I enjoy doing makeup. So the only thing with it is that I feel like I'm wasting product, but I'm not going to be using it to go anywhere else. So may as well use it for that um what else i'm trying to think like i made a tiktok yet the other day um where i just kind of like filmed little clips of throughout my day so that i can and i'm going to do that like a couple of times throughout this month just to kind of have some accountability of what i've been doing and oh I had a zoom call last night <sighs> I don't know how I feel about bringing back the zoom calls the zoom quizzes kind of want to leave that in the last time but I do have friends who are spread about all over the place so last night I had um like a call with some of the girls from Disney the UK girls um so that was really good to have a catch up with them because I haven't really spoken to them since when I went to Edinburgh um, and then today I'm supposed to be FaceTiming my sister who is away in Dubai at the minute so that'll be good to have a catch up with her and tomorrow I have another video call with like my apartment girls from Disney so people spread all across the globe we have to like combine our time zones <laughs> to try and arrange this call um, but yeah I think keeping in touch with your friends and keeping connected with people is going to be really important this time round. Obviously it's winter, it's darker, it's literally getting dark outside right now and it's like half past three. Um, so yeah, I think keeping in touch with all your friends is really important. And that's the thing like this time round, I felt a bit more, not isolated because I'm living with my friends, um, but other than the people I'm living with, I've sometimes felt a bit cut off and like, I don't know, not that I've lost people because they're still my friends, they're still there, they'll message me occasionally or whatever, um, but that's just felt a bit different this time and I feel like I'd just been at Disney, literally living like my best life, travelling, seeing the world, meeting new people and then we've come back um, and obviously there was the in-between stage of where I was at home that was kind of like the initial coronavirus is a thing we've got to stay inside blah 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 and then I've come to uni it was kind of like things getting better and now I feel like we're a bit stuck like things just aren't the same uni's not the same as it used to be and um, we're not going in for actual university some of my friends that I lived with in previous years like one of them is graduated now so obviously I don't really see her there's no societies really like I could have gone back to dance but obviously now there is no dance um so there's not that there's not the socials like I think things just aren't the same and that's why this one's a bit harder but we just need to try and focus on the positives and that's what I'm trying to do now this is my focus today as I said, I worked out this morning, I had my lunch, I had a bath, um, I've got myself ready, I took some Instagram pictures, like literally finding anything to fill my day. 
um, I don't want me, tea break. I also, when I had moisturised after the bath, I was letting my moisturiser soak in. And I like, um, I'd ordered some new pillowcases, I put those on. I also put, if you watched the like, um, my new uni house video, you will remember the base of my bed is like a really ugly pattern, like the actual base underneath the mattress, do you know what I mean? So I'd ordered um, like a cover, I can't even remember what they're called, but it's basically like a white sheet that goes over the top of the base and down the sides to hide the base itself. So I put that on today, I had to lift my whole mattress off my bed on my own. Um, I've watered my plan, like I'm just trying to find the little things um, to keep myself occupied and feel productive. But like I said, if you want to take this time to not be productive, do it. Like, you're never going to, well, obviously this all depends on your situation. A lot of people are still going to work. Um, if you're in school, you're in school. Like, a lot of people's lives haven't changed much. I feel like for uni students were perhaps a bit different like obviously we're away from our families as well as um everything else like not having restaurants and stuff open but then again like i said i'm living with my friends there are a lot of people out there who live on their own um so we just gotta get on with it unfortunately that's just the situation isn't it but yeah what else I feel like I'm gonna start making to-do lists again sometimes um just to kind of structure my day a bit make sure I'm getting done what I want to get done and um, and stuff like that what else oh this is something that I was just thinking about downstairs um one of my like aims for this month is to stop spending I am obviously a student I live in a house I have to pay rent and bills um and like I can't go out I can't go out and go to a restaurant or go on a night out and spend money that way I can't go to the shops and spend money so why spend when I can try and save because ideally I would like to go home at Christmas not being in my overdraft I think that's gonna be impossible but being very little into my overdraft like we don't want to touch it if we don't have to do you know what I mean so that's one of my goals is to stop spending just spend on the necessities food bills rent and the odd treat like I don't know if I really fancy a coffee or something then I might order a Starbucks but in general I am gonna try and stop spending but One thing making that difficult is the sales at the minute. Like, I've got a bow and tea set on now um, underneath this. Um, because they had an offer on and it was the full set for £30, which I just thought was too good to not do, especially when everyone else in my house was also ordering a set. I just thought I might have to do it. Motivate me doing my home workouts. So, yeah, um, that was my last treat. And now I'm going to stick to Christmas presents, bills and food and just try and be a bit more conscious of my finances because I think that's important. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else I have to say. I feel like this has been a bit of a, like I hadn't sit, sat down and thought about what I was going to say for this video until I literally sat down. I've just brain farted onto the video. Um, but yeah i've just thought i'd do a little chatty video seeing as i look somewhat presentable today which i don't usually um but yeah i hope this video was helpful even if like it just made you sit and take a minute and have a cup of tea and just chill for a minute then that's good like um I don't know. <laughs> I just hope you enjoyed the video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. And don't forget to follow me on my other things, which I'll put down below. Um, 
and yeah i'll probably try and do another video in the next few weeks just to keep things rolling and give me something else to do so if you have any ideas of things that i can maybe film then feel free to comment them down below and yeah thanks for watching i'll see you next time